Uh, obviously, you know, a top one against the U Juve Golden Bears. Uh, for me personally, it was the first time seeing that. What, what did uh, what you tell you guys coming into this hockey game about the Bears? What you expect? And, uh, did, did you expect, you know, for them to come out that strong? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I knew exactly what we were going to get get into. They're a quick transition team, uh, get their defensemen involved. They move the puck very well. They're very skilled. And uh, so, you know what, they uh, they treated us to uh, you know, some very good hockey. I think it was an eye-opener for our guys when uh, when we were ready to compete. Uh, I thought I thought we handled ourselves fairly well. Uh, for some you know, parts of the game, we were able to keep them to the outside. But, uh, um, you know what, it forces us to pay attention to detail and it highlights areas of our game that we absolutely, we're not even close to being able to, to, to perform at a level that's going to really make us successful this year. So. Uh, you know what? Uh, happy with uh, some performance from some players overall. You know to be out shot the way we did. Uh, I think it reflects of uh, the pace of the game and and the dominance that the Bears demonstrated tonight. So do you think the first period by you guys kind of showed some? I guess um, I, I wouldn't say butterflies, but maybe trying to get back in the deep of things. I haven't skated for a while. Some guys trying to find their legs. Uh, Zabdo don't say they had a tough time behind the net in the first period. You know what, I think it was just a case that we were just sitting around watching and letting the play come to us instead of, you know, trying to establish a little bit of a, a pace and uh, maybe playing a little bit of smart hockey. So, you know what, it was uh, it was a big eye-opener for us. And uh, like even then, it was kind of tough for us to get into any kind of rhythm. And that's a, that just speaks to the puck possession uh, game that they play, and they, they did a good job. And of course, with Shani, you know, she faced a lot of shots in the first period. She got run over a few times in the game. I mean, she had a heck of a game, even though the guys lost 3 2 tonight. Oh, absolutely. And she's been like that all year. So, uh, no, I didn't expect anything different from her. And uh, she rises to these kind of challenges. And, uh, uh, you know, it was a great game on her part.